ABC6 investigators are targeting power bills tonight. Uh, power bills that are doubling and tripling with no warning for no apparent reason. Investigator Brooks DeRose is on Waste Watch tonight trying to track down the costly cause. Brooks? Well, guys, in Columbus, American Electric Power has the corn around the market. But to what end will AEP go to make sure you're paying for only what you use? Well, in one young woman's case, she's still fighting and on the losing end. As the dial spins, the kilowatts add up, and you're charged for everything that's powered up. When I leave, I turn the AC off. It might be on for one or two hours a day. Kelly Mary lives in this apartment and saw her bill go from about $100 to, in some cases, more than $1,000. It's definitely really stressful and irritating. She called American Electric Power, which at first admitted making a mistake and removed a nearly $600 charge. But next month, bills show that charge was re-added. We have initiated an investigation into your concern. AEP sent a crew to check the meter and found the meter was operating at 100% and saying no billing adjustments are needed. I don't know how they could say I'm using 4,000 kilowatts in a little 900 square foot apartment. So we called our own electrician. David Deal is with DA Electrical. Checking the panel inside, Deal first looks at the power load with everything turned off. Right now, she's reading less than an amp on the whole service. Then again, with everything turned back on. About 37 amps, that's still not a whole lot for this service. With no loose connections, it's back outside to look at the meter. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna open up your meter okay. and I'm gonna check connections on your end. Yeah, see those are tight. Again, no loose connections, only a dial that's spinning fast. Personally, I think it's the meter. Still, AEP claims the meter is working properly. Deal says AEP's test may have not been for a long enough period of time. It's completely like my hands are tied with it. I can't go somewhere else because AP is the only service provider. So we filed a complaint with the Public Utilities Commission. Now, two weeks later, the only response, we're expecting a reply from AEP this week. And we did ask AEP about Kelly Mary's bills and meter. The company said it could not discuss a customer's concerns with us. Now, if you have a dispute with AEP, you need to call the Public Utilities Commission. I'm Investigator Brooks DeRose, ABC6 News.